Hi, this is Brian. Welcome back to another Optimize Plus One. Not too long ago, we chatted about Ryan Holiday's latest book, Stillness is the Key. Since then, he and I connected for an interview you might enjoy, which is linked in the Plus One. Today, I want to chat about another brilliant passage from that book. This one's on sleep. Here it is. Ryan says, quote, The philosopher and writer Arthur Schopenhauer used to say, that sleep is the source of all health and energy. He said it better still on a separate occasion. Sleep is the interest we have to pay on the capital which is called in at death. The higher the interest rate and the more regularly it is paid, the further the date of redemption, end quote. That's today's plus one. Two parts. Part one. Know that, as Schopenhauer puts it, sleep is the source of all health and energy. Or, as we've discussed so many times, sleep is the foundation on which all the other pillars of health rest. Thanks again to Matthew Walker for that distinction. Recall his wisdom. I quote Matthew, quote, I was once fond of saying, sleep is the third pillar of good health alongside diet and exercise. I have changed my tune. Sleep is more than a pillar. It is the foundation on which the other two health bastions sit. Take away the bedrock of sleep or weaken it just a little and careful eating or physical exercise become less than effective, as we shall see, end quote. Part two, you know that debt we all have on our life balance sheet called death? Memento mori, baby. Check out that plus one. Let's manage it well. As we remember, I quote again, sleep is the interest we have to pay on the capital, which is called in at death. The higher the interest rate and the more regularly it is paid, the further the date of redemption. In other words, here's to optimizing our sleep so we can feel great today for a lot more yet always finite todays. Practically speaking, how can you optimize your sleep? Get on that tonight.